Okay, in this video, I'm going to show you how to turn in your Onshape shapes uh, for a grade. So what you're going to want to do is I'm going to show you through this document is you're going to go to your Onshape and then you're going to put the images of your work on your home page of Onshape. And I'll show you how to do that in a second by using this here grid view that Onshape has to offer in the top right corner. And you're going to make uh, your screen nice and big so you can see all your pictures so that it looks something like this with your shapes on the, on the screen. And then you're going to utilize the, the shortcut on your Chromebook keyboard to use Control and this Window Switch key, which should be located towards the top of your Chromebook keyboard. And that's going to allow you to take a screenshot. And once your screenshot is taken, you're going to submit that screenshot in your uh, Onshape file in your Google Classroom uh, where the project instructions were located. So I'm going to show you how to do that right now. So on the Onshape screen, what you want to do first is you want to close this details window off on the right hand side. And you also want to eliminate this last open by me so that your screen becomes bigger. If you click on this grid view here, you'll notice that your images become larger. When you have all your shapes on your screen, you will take the screenshot. When you take the screenshot, you should see a little indicator pop up on the bottom of your screen telling you that you have taken a screenshot. That screenshot goes right to your files. So the next thing you'll need to do is to go to Google Classroom. Once you're in Google Classroom, you need to click on the Add button where you add your work. And I can't show you, unfortunately, on my computer because I don't have a, a Chromebook. So you'll have to um, picture what it is I'm describing. You will click on the Add button, and then you will click on Browse for Files. OK, and at your Files folder, if you click on Recents, you should see that right at the top. It'll be a screenshot. You'll select the screenshot and hit Open. And then you'll get an option to turn it in after it downloads. Hit Turn In twice, and then you should see that you have a screenshot that has been turned in, much like the ones here that students have turned in for me already. OK? And hopefully that will help you through this submission process. Thanks, and good luck.